squash is officially back in South Africa and with big names competing at the national championships, all eyes will be on the country's top player, JP Brits, who is eager to get back to action after being away from the sport he loves due to the pandemic. ZDTN CS Duplessis has more. South Africa's number one squash player is chomping at the bit to be back on the squash court. And after six months of one of the strictest lockdowns in the world, JP Brits has been able to pick up his racket once again and finally has an opportunity to retain his national title and return to the professional squash circuit, the PSA World Tour. You know, in the beginning we were very hopeful, you know, just a couple of weeks being off um, and we were still motivated to train hard, but as the months gone on it was really hard to stay motivated not knowing when your next event will be. And then obviously since the restrictions have been lifted, we've been very excited to train and, and get back on court. And uh, starting our events this month is a really amazing uh, feeling for us to get back and compete again. The 29-year-old who spends six months of the year competing overseas believes that squash in South Africa is headed in the right direction and has all the potential to become a dominant force. I think South Africa squash is really healthy like all around generally, like school squash, master squash, university squash, that's really healthy. We're just lacking a little bit of high performance. So if we can get good structures in place to focus on high performance, then we can really do well internationally as well. Squash remains a Commonwealth Games regular, but for some reason is outside of the IOC's plans, which is disappointing for the man who, along with his doubles partner, Christo Portgita, won bronze at the World Championships last year. Any sportsman dreams to become an Olympian and to, to go to the Olympics and it's a pity that squash players can't have that dream and it will definitely be a big benefit for us to be able to do that and that will give kids like something to look forward to you know and say well one, one day I want to go to the Olympics as a squash player and that will definitely draw a lot of players to say I want to play squash as well and not just look to all the other sports so in, in terms of exposure that will be a big plus for squash and I think uh, we should definitely still keep pushing that to, to get into the Olympics one day. JP Britt says the lockdown has provided good rest from the rigors of competing year in and year out in a grueling international season. But the SA number one is eager to get back competing. His next objective is to defend his national title and has targeted breaking into the world's top 50 in the next 12 months. CSW Plessis, CGTN, Johannesburg.